Today is Eurydice's 19th birthday. It's a day she never imagined being around to witness. Her teenage years were often full of moments that felt rotten to the core. That was until she met Orpheus. He was 18, a poet, and quickly became the love of her life. She found herself enthralled by the way he allowed himself to be free through his work. She was quite the opposite, you see. Her mother would say that as a kid, she was wound up so tight she resembled a coil spring. What her mother really meant was that she resembled her father, a man who had a quick temper and an even quicker exit strategy. Orpheus, however, was nothing like her father. He was patient, kind. He even felt like the feeling you get when you smell freshly cut grass in spring. That feeling is what kept her alive. For every day she waited in the underworld, her thoughts would quickly turn sour. But Orpheus, he was the right amount of sickly sweet to sway her darkest thoughts. Today is Eurydice's 19th birthday. She's going home. As she walks down an empty tunnel in pitch darkness, all she can hear is the sound of her anxious breathing. She knows that Orpheus is in front of her. He would never abandon her. Today is Eurydice's 19th birthday. He let go.